Now I'm going to show you how to anchor down the inertial wave strong. Ideally, you want to have both tubes at about 24 to 36 inches apart, which is about an arm's length apart. That makes it easier for you to just attach it anywhere. You can attach these to weight racks like the one I have here. You can attach it to rails. You can attach it to fences, dumbbells. I've even used it on my trampoline. Now what you want to do is you have both ends here of the inertial wave strong. You have an O-ring on one end, and then you have this uh, wire loop at the other end for the attachments for the handles. So what you want to do is you want to grab your rail strap. The rail strap has a loop on one end. You have a carabiner on the other end and you want to throw the strap around the anchor point that you're using. So I'm going to throw it around the rack. I have my carabiner here and I'm going to thread that carabiner through the loop and now I pull as tight as I can so that it stays securely on there. Now all you're going to do is you're going to grab that o-ring clip it onto the carabiner and then you're ready to go. Now what you want to do is if you want to just work on the metabolic conditioning part then you just grab the handle here by the end. If you wanted to work on the resistance training part then you attach the carabiner to the wire loop here at the end and you're ready to go. So just as simple as that all you need to do is find an anchor point about 24 to 36 inches apart about waist high and then you're ready to work out.